In the dry Atacama Desert in Peru, the sands reveal treasures more valuable than gold. The objects and remains of an ancient Peruvian people called the Chiribaya. Hundreds of years ago, the dry air and sand of the desert naturally preserved and mummified the dead bodies of the Cherubaya people. For archaeologists, these mummies are silent and powerful witnesses of ancient history. The Cherubaya people lived in southern Peru in a valley from the Pacific coast to around 40 kilometers inland. At one time, there were 30,000 people living in the valley, but not much is known about the culture of the Chiribaya people. Their simple buildings made of mud and sticks did not survive. Everything archeologists know about the Chiribaya comes from their tombs. They have discovered many treasures buried with the mummies, such as gold cups, earrings, and decorations. However, the archaeology has brought thieves looking for gold. Greedy, greedy people, just tomb after tomb, they would just open the tombs, get the mummy bundles, or get the mummies, and the word was that the gold was inside the mouth. So they would separate the skull from the rest of the body and crack the skull. It's just awful and annoying that we can't stop it. Archaeologists must work fast to beat the thieves. A new tomb has been discovered. Inside the tomb is a complete mummy, wrapped in a striped blanket with an offering of llama feet in a basket to represent food. In a laboratory, the archaeologists unwrap the body. The head has gray hair. They then remove the body's blankets. This mummy was a very old man. The way his body was preserved shows he was an important member of Chiribaya society. It is the job of archaeologists to help reveal the secrets of the Chiribaya people. However, because of the destruction of the mummies by treasure hunters, many mysteries of these ancient people will never be solved.